Hello Cancers and welcome back to my channel Luma Moon Tarot. So Cancers I know I'm a little bit off on my daily scheduled reading right. Um, I should have had this out for you way like a long time ago but I found out really late last night that I'm having kind of unexpected visitors today from out of town so um, so yeah, I had some things that I had to take care of in the house, you know, but, um, anyway, Cancers, I'm back with you now, my darlings. I'm so sorry. I love you all so much. Um, so anyway, Cancers, this reading is for the collective. It may or may not resonate with you. Okay. Just take what does resonate. Toss out the rest. Don't try to force anything. And thank you, my darlings, so much for your likes, subscribes, comments, shares, donations, everything, everything that you guys do. Um, thank you so much for all of your support. I truly mean that. All right, Divine, what do you have for Cancer? Ooh, Cancer, somebody sees you. Oh, my gosh, here they come. Somebody's coming towards you, Cancer. They really want to heal this. They see you as the Ten of Pentacles, okay? <laughs> That's pretty much everything. That's a dream life. Um, I feel like this person wants to come towards you here, uh, get you to calmer waters, but um, you guys know I don't like the the picture on this card. I really don't. But this person's coming. They're taking action here. Yeah. Yep, this person's bossing up, man. Cancer. <laughs> you could be dealing with a Taurus, a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Leo. Heavy on water. They want this. I feel like it's heavy on water because this person can't contain how they feel anymore. And they want to take control of this situation fast. This is somebody who played you before in the past, I feel, but... You know, honestly, they're, they've been hiding how they feel, and they're ready to pop. Look, they're ready to pop for you, Cancer. This person's making a decision. They're coming in fast. They, um, you could be dealing with the Sagittarius, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. They know that you're the one for them. I feel like this person played you in the past. That's what these swords are. They, they played you in the past here, Cancer. They hid something from you, possibly that, well, one, they knew what they were doing, I feel. Um, they knew what they were doing. This could be somebody that you knew for, like, years or since childhood, even. You could have gone to school with this person. You could even have children with them for some of you. I'm just feeling like the, uh, they can't get over you, Cancer. Um, yeah, this person's making a decision. Page of Swords here, um, getting ready to, yeah. I feel like this person, um, they're in a lot of regret here. There, there could have been a lot of rumors and gossip about you, Cancer. I'm seeing these as two different people, though, talking to each other. And this person's in a lot of regret because they believed somebody else just spreading rumors or um they could even be worried about this page of swords coming to spread some kind of rumor we just had that too heartache and it's just caused a lot of heartache and betrayal look at this whatever this person went to instead of you there was no love in the it just didn't work out i feel like um maybe they were when they met you i feel like they were praying for the right person to come in, but they turned their nose up at you. They were still upset with things that had happened to them in the past, okay? Now I feel like they listen to rumors or gossip. Somebody talked to somebody about you here, Cancer. They heard something and or something, and it's, it's led to nothing but heartache for this person. Um... Yeah, they're realizing here that you're the blessing in love. They're realizing what they lost. And if this person's in another relationship, I feel like that's coming down too. That's about to crumble. 
Yeah, they're happy whatever they went to that they thought was was um, the grass was greener, right? They could have had more something, happiness, something, a home situation. It's it's over. Yeah, some kind of family situation maybe. I feel like it's over. Whoever they're with could be flirting with someone else too in a third party situation. Yeah, because this person's feeling betrayed. They're finding out about it. They're feeling very betrayed. Yeah, I feel like maybe this Page of Swords energy, this is who they were with, right? I feel like they met somebody new. They've been having some kind of flirtatious sexual. It could have been um, to get this person jealous. They put them in a third party situation. They've been ju they've just been betrayed. Um, they could be going out drinking right now, but I it, I'm seeing this as somebody who drinks a lot. Maybe they're this is somebody who played a little game with you as well. Now they want to come in and apologize here for all of this betrayal. Yeah, this is a cycle that's coming to an end. Yep, they know that uh, this connection was sabotaged, Cancer. And they're realizing that whatever family situation or home situation that they went to um, instead of you, they ended up getting betrayed here. This karmic individual, I'm seeing this as two different people. Okay, communicating, flirting, um, maybe even, you know, I can sometimes see this as gossip. But this person's been put in a third party. The exact same thing they did to you, Cancer, is happening to them, like right now. And this is coming to an end here with ten swords in this person's back. Yep. Now they want to come towards you, Cancer, and give you this apology, but they're looking at that fish like, I don't know if it's going to be enough after I betrayed Cancer so bad I stabbed them in the back. I should have defended them when I had the chance and I didn't. And now I'm coming to find out that the person that I went to instead is having some kind of affair with somebody possibly, well, it seems like this is somebody their own age, you know. Maybe a bit younger. Young and immature. Yeah. This person just, they didn't, yeah, they didn't learn from, I feel like they could have been finding out this through some other kind of gossip. And they just, they may have even all, like you could have warned them or something about this. Yeah, they kept the wrong person stuck in their mind. I feel like they gave, they tried to build a happy home life, a family situation. I feel it was fake um, with this karmic individual over here, right? But they're seeing you as the one that they can trust. They're seeing you as the one that they can build something solid with. That's the feeling that I'm getting here. And they want to come back towards you. They may even tell you about the pain that they're going through here, Cancer. But they, this is somebody, I feel, who's had you in a mental mind trap. And now they're totally regretting it, okay? Because they they just got cheated on. They're finding out that the person that they're with has somebody else. Possibly somebody younger. And now this person, you know, like I said, they don't know if this apology is even going to be worth anything after this. The same thing they did to you, I feel, is being done to them. And they're really feeling this, the pain of that. Remember, remember when they did that to you, all the pain you felt? That's how they're feeling now. All of these swords that they had you in a mental mind trap in are all going back in this person's back. Yeah, they're just finding out they were cheated on cancer. And they know they, they hid things from you. I feel like they took advantage of you here. Okay? You would have never hurt this person wearing mittens. I feel like you were honest with them. I feel like they were covering something up here. 
when they offered you that cup of love you were this is innocent love from you okay and I feel like they took advantage of that you could have really looked up to this person you know you could have saw them as oh wow you know what I mean um yeah this they are no they're getting their karma here the truth has come out the truth has come out and this person is taking ten swords to the back the same way they gave it to you cancer okay yeah now they're feeling like a total fool wanting to take a leap of faith and come towards their high priestess I feel like that's you the intuitive one the one who's connected to God yeah they feel like a fool because they were in a toxic situation here you could be dealing with I've got Virgo on the bottom of the deck Aries Capricorn Scorpio more Aries here more Scorpio Pisces Leo Taurus Leo Aries Sagittarius and water signs Cancer Scorpio Pisces yeah they know that it was toxic now they kept you in a mental mind trap betrayed you right kept you sitting here with no clarity no answers no nothing and come to find out now um, they were in a toxic situation the whole time the whole time all right so what is this person I feel like they're coming towards you here feeling like a fool what are they gonna say to cancer I want to know what they want to say to you because I know they're showing up cancer okay <laughs> they're showing up my darling so whether you want this person back or not I feel like it's the end of a cycle okay they're getting their karma right now for what they did exactly what they did to you cancer they're getting okay um yeah and I feel like this is the judgment call this they're under judgment because they didn't close the cycle out properly they still need to come forward and close it out properly with you whether you take them back or not whether you want them back or not after what they did they still have to close the cycle out and do the right thing they are being called to do the right thing feeling like a fool I feel like this person um, they could do impulsive things cancer they're coming to you you know remember um, we got the chariot here with the player card I feel like they this is somebody who definitely played you in the past but I'm feeling that um, what I'm really getting here is they're getting their clarity they're getting their karma they're getting the pain that they gave you okay they're getting um, their judgment all right um, and they're also getting really passionate now about moving forward I, I just keep hearing we follow the North Star so I feel like their um, compass is like pointing to the North Node um, wanting to take that action okay knowing where they have to go and what they have to do that's the feeling that I'm getting letting you down was the worst decision I made you were the love of my life I didn't figure that out before I know now that it's true telling you cancer I'm getting I'm getting the goosebumps it hurts to see online that you've moved on with your life I want to contact your mutual friends to ask about you I let my ego get in our way I couldn't let go of my pride but you saw through me you know the truth about me it was easier being with someone from my world see I feel like cancer that that was part of the issue too you're the high priestess you probably call this person out like you're very intuitive okay and they they I feel like they knew they weren't gonna get away with anything from you or they, that's the you were a big temptation for this person and they um, they may have seen you as being naive easy to use okay something like that um, but here's the thing though they know that you're intuitive you weren't gonna I mean you were gonna 
trust your intuition on this person so they chose to stay with somebody here a karmic individual that could have even been codependent um, because it was easier it was easier and I feel like something about your intuition, yeah, it threw them off is what I heard. It threw them off. Like they were nervous about it or it was different, right? It wasn't what they were used to, but they didn't realize that what they were used to was toxic. They're realizing that now. They're realizing that now, Cancer. I keep hearing we follow the North Star, so you could be in um, star energy right now. Let's see how this person's feeling, okay? Let's go through their emotions. Because I want to, Cancer, I just want to see what kind of emotions this person is having. Um, yeah, they know they've been away from you for far too long. I feel like now their compass is getting righted. The divine is making them come in and do the right thing by you, is what I'm seeing. One way, yeah, I'm hearing one way or another. I'm going to find you. I'm going to get you, get you, get you. <laughs> I feel like this person ran away from what they did to you or they tried to. They tried to ignore it. They tried to forget about it. They tried to think that you, you know, that you were nothing and they were wrong. They tried to think that, that what they did to you didn't matter, but it they can't run from it. it the divine is saying one way or another they're going to get this person they're going to find them i'm going to get you get you get you get you yeah yeah so um yeah here you are moving forward taking leaps of faith how does this person feel you know, you could have had ba a baby with this person. I kind of feel like this is two choices that they have. You, confident, single, um, abundant, moving forward, okay, courageous, self-assured, bold. And I feel like this is somebody who is codependent in a family situation. But it was just, it was like being with like friends with benefits it was easier for this person to settle for with whoever they were with but i feel like it was codependent they could have had a child with this person yeah they're feeling very lonely right now it's like their high vibes are pulling them to you cancer and whoever they're with now um they just don't uh resonate with these people anymore they just don't they thought it would be easier to stay with the same group of people that they stayed with before or be with the same types of people. And they're realizing that it's just making them feel isolated and alone. They're disgusted with their choices. They're disgusted. I feel like this person's bossing up, wanting to take control back of their life. They could be disgusted with this whole situation here, wherever they are, with being with it. They're just tired of the of the situation that they've got going on with this karmic, and they're getting hurt. They're disgusted and in a lot of regret. I've got desperate on the bottom of the deck. But, you know, this tower came down for a reason. It was to push this person out of a karmic situation, away from the devil, and back towards you to do the right thing. Whether you take them back or not. You know, um, the divine is working in both of everybody's lives right now. So, yeah, desperate comes out again. And longing, look, they are so regretful. Now they're longing for you, Cancer. Okay, and I feel like they've been looking at your photos or watching you um whatever it is that you're doing they can't stop thinking about you and now they're desperate for a way to come in because they totally screwed this up and they got cheated on and they got ten swords to the back anyway oh man yeah cancer all right how else does this person feel about cancer confused they don't know how to get back in i'm telling you 
they don't know how to get back in and now um, they may be finding out that some of you are um, could be with somebody else this is a big issue for this person like all they can think about is what is cancer doing who is cancer with they're feeling very possessive now because now they want you back so bad it's that passion that north following the north star you i feel like you're their wish and they want to make a beeline towards you cancer but um man they don't know how to come back in if you get with somebody else they're gonna have to let this dream go okay they could be very envious if you're already out there dating because the the star energy that's really the feeling that i'm getting here um is you know puts herself out there right for others to see so they they know that some of you are on the dating scene yeah and if that's the case it's hopeless it didn't quite come out because they don't know for sure that's why they want to talk to your friends about you I want to contact our mutual friends to ask about you. Yeah, I'm telling you. All right, what else can you show me here for this person? Powerless. They just don't know what to do. They just don't know what to do. And they're, yeah, they're de really depressed because they've been far too resistant to come forward this whole time. They wasted their time in a toxic situation. They settled for somebody that they thought would be easier to be with. But it was more like a friends with benefits that they had. The, it was more like a buddy buddy or something like that. But they had a family with them. And now this person is finding out that they were cheated on. They're really disgusted by all of this because they've missed their chance with you after mistreating you so badly, Cancer. You know, and then leaving you alone for a long time, you know. They know that this apology may not be worth much. And they don't even know how to come forward. All they're doing right now is watching you. And you know what? Here, all of this is going on in the background, Cancer, and here you are. Calm, serene, centered, peaceful. Um, manifesting a new life for yourself, right? And they are a, they are a mess. They're a mess. And they're desperate. They don't know what to do. They don't know what to do. But it's like a desperation, but at the same time, they're, they've just been betrayed. This karmic, whoever they're with, this Page of Swords energy, has somebody else that they're flirting with. They have someone else, third party. Toxicity. All right, give me one more for Cancer. But expect this person to come back in. Uh, they just don't know what would be a good way. Okay, but this person's coming back in. I feel like um, they have to. That's kind of the feeling that I'm getting is they have to. The divine is kind of pressing this person, you know, more and more and more. And now they're realizing <laughs> they're feeling that same pain they gave you, Cancer, for real. All right, give me one more for this person, how they feel about cancer. I, maybe that's it. Maybe I got it all, guys. A lot creative. Maybe thinking of it, yeah. Trying to figure out an ease, a, a creative way to express themselves here. But they're exhausted. They're spent. I feel like they don't they don't have a way. They don't have a creative way to come forward. They don't have a really good apology here. You know? So, yeah, this this person they're feeling very powerless, uh but they want to come forward right now. Um they're just doing a lot of watching and hoping that you're not with somebody else. Asking friends about you. 
but this person's in love with you cancer and they're they're very regretful okay um, and they're getting this they're getting the same kind of heartache and treatment that they gave you right now anyway cancers listen that's what I've got for this reading um, I hope this helps I hope it resonates right um, and thanks again guys for being patient with me today I got a lot going on but I love you so so much um, yeah like and subscribe if you like this vibe and it resonates and until next time my darlings take care of you and peace out